friends! Welcome back to my channel and welcome to one of my like still year-end cozy type videos. Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about Merit Beauty. I have talked about this brand for a while now and I talked about it even last year because I have been trying things as a lot of us have been getting more into the natural makeup lines. Yes, some of us are just still working from home. Some of us still just want an easy breezy look. Now, keep in mind it is the holiday season right now so what i am doing is kind of taking some of these more natural pieces that i know have worked well for those natural days and transitioning them just a bit into the holiday times i am super excited to say merit beauty is sponsoring today's video and i'm going to go through some of the three things that i have really loved this holiday season to pull together a look that is either really great for a very simplistic natural look or a look that I can transition to that holiday a little bit more glam vibe. I've even used some of these things going in to some work meetings at year end, holiday parties, things like that. So grab your tea, grab your snack, grab your water, get comfy, get cozy with me as we put together some beautiful, natural, but also holiday festive makeup with Merit Beauty. Cheers! I was recently gifted three different products from Merit Beauty to give another go-to because some things are newer to my collection and some things I've actually had in my collection for quite some time, some things I needed a restock of. Starting with something that so many of you guys when I posted my last Merit video were like, girl, that's the stuff that everybody's talking about. This is the Merit Beauty Instant Glow Serum. This is something you need to mix together and then put on your face. I showed you guys even in a recent video how well this transitioned my face that is very sensitive. Like when you lightly touch my face, it turns red. So when I applied this, my face really went red. So I know that can scare some people, but when you saw how good my skin looked mere minutes later, it was definitely still that very glowy, dewy look. And I will be real with you. Yes, I live in Florida, but we have all been dealing with a cold snap right now, right? It has been in the 30s and 40s, and my skin has dried out like that. So I have actually been looking for a lot of glowy, dewy, hydrating serums to help my skin because my skin is so not used to this cold anymore. And it really kind of just sucked the moisture out of the air. So we have the heater on. We have so many things that my skin is like, what is happening? So when I was putting this on, I knew that this would give me that hydration back, that glow back that makes my skin and my makeup that I put on top of it really just perform really well. Not let anything look like it's creping apart or busting apart because of dry skin, which I forgot was a factor. This is actually such a popular item that it looks like right now it is out of stock. It is $38 on their website. And I actually have a small one from the holiday special that I did for you guys with their holiday little bundle they have. So I had one for travel and now I have one for home. And right now with the way the weather has gone, I really appreciate having something that makes my skin look great and hydrated and glowy with or without makeup. I really like that, especially because I'm freezing. Something else I love about everything with Merit Beauty is they are vegan, cruelty-free, everything is clean, and I do like that I can layer it up to do a more holiday festive look if I want to, because a lot of times when I've used these products in the past, it's been very minimalistic makeup, very like no makeup makeup, but right now it's that time of year where I wanna do just a touch more. This product is hydrating, lightweight, dewy finish, and it also is plumping for your skin, which sounds like the perfect combination, yes? I had not gotten to try this before this year, so, so far I'm really enjoying this and finding that my skin does really have some bounce to it and some glow to it when I use this. Now I was recently rediscovered to an old friend. I have said historically for years and years, I am not a blush girl, but, but, okay, I'll say it, over the past, I would say two and a half years maybe, I have been leaning a little bit more into a rosy cheek, but I still don't like an overwhelming blush. It's still just not my thing. I don't care how on trend it is. So this is something that I really liked in the summertime. So I was curious how it was going to work for me right now in this cold snap of winter time. This is their flush balm. This is their cheek color. This is a cream tint that melts into your skin with this lit from within color that stays flush all day. And I would say this would be really great for that trend that's going around right now, that cold girl trend where you can kind of build it up on the cheeks and on the nose to give you that I'm cold look. I did that this morning and I was 
always worried about how a cream will apply on my oily skin. It's not oily right now though because it's really dry out because I am still a powder lover when I'm setting my foundations and I need to put on this before I do powder. So I was like, how's this gonna play with the rest of my makeup? And this really built up beautifully. I could just do a light touch if I wanted to, or I could build it up a little bit more. And I thought that did really well. It wasn't pulling off my foundation. It wasn't pulling off any concealer. And then when I went to powder it down, I thought it did a great job. Everything is still visible, but it's not overwhelming. It's not that pow of blush that I personally don't like. But if you want to build it up even more, you have that capability with this formula, which is really nice. And this is coming from a girl with also bossy pores. I'm always worried cream products are going to like settle into like creases or pores and really age me or give me texture that I don't want. I do not see any of that on today's makeup look or even on my light makeup days. But heavier makeup days where I'm wanting a little bit more of that holiday glam, I was worried truthfully but look it is not there in the least you see that flush of color but you don't see anything that's looking textured or pulling in a negative light it looks great the shade that i have is beverly hills and i really thought this was a nice complementary color to a natural look for me but also if i wanted to build it up i figured i could and i can they call this blendable, lightweight, satin finish, and multi-use. And I could see that for sure. Now this is $28. So this is a product that is a little bit more on the high-end line, but it is very malleable. It's very easy to use. And I feel like you're gonna get a lot of uses out of this. At least I will, for sure. Come in a variety of colors. And I really feel like this is gonna be something for a little bit of everyone because as I was playing with this and adding to it, I realized when I'm more tan in the summer, I could build this up a little bit more, maybe even just add more product to my fingers or use a brush. Today I used my fingertips because I wanted to build it and see how I could apply it, but I could easily see you using a brush for this as well to get an even heavier application for more color. I'm in natural sun today and I absolutely see the rosiness of the cheeks and it's not pulling away, it's not overwhelming, and it's all really smooth. It's not shiny either. I worry a lot of times about cream products on my skin type being too shiny and I'm not having that struggle. I think it looks really nice and I'm excited to continue to use this in the winter, but also when I'm doing more natural, no makeup makeup looks in the summer, I think this is gonna come in really nice to just be that suntan kissed look. And now my favorite thing from Merit. I have so many of these in my collection. I have loved a lot of their lip products to the point that I actually have a lot of their bullet lipsticks just chilling over here on the top part of my vanity because I do think that they're a really creamy formula. But the way I was introduced to Merit lip products were from all of their glosses. I have four of these because I love them. These are actually tinted lip oils, which is like, this is the perfect time of year to be pulling out their lip oils. I call them glosses just because they're so opaque. I forget that they're a lip oil when I have been using it as a lip gloss. Today's shade that I got was taupe, but I also have so many in my collection here. I have All Natural, which I think is a great tone as well. It's got a little bit more warmth to it, so it works really well for fall, spring, summer. This one I felt like was a little bit deeper and richer, the taupe shade, because I feel like it kind of adds to the depth of the berry looks that I like to do this time of year. Very smooth, but also very, very opaque. You can wear these alone or you can do just some liner underneath and put this on directly and it's super easy. This again is more of the like full face holiday going into work meetings, doing holiday parties vibe and I think this is so beautiful. The way they describe these on their website is they say that they are moisturizing, buildable, lightweight and a high shine finish. I totally agree. In the summertime, one of my favorite things to do is get the All Natural shade, which is a little bit of a lip liner just to make the lips look a little bit plumper. Put this on and the high gloss shine makes it look like you have that big summer pout. I also love doing that though in the winter time when I'm wanting just a little bit more of a fuller lip look, I put this on top. Super comfortable even over the top of either a liquid lipstick if you're still loving those or a lip liner and it's so opaque. Like, let me show you one stroke of that. You can build this, but at the same time, you can still see the skin underneath, but look how opaque this is. 
I really love how this lays on the skin. I love the hydration I get from it as well. I feel like the blush is very similar in the respect that you can see it immediately, but then you can also build it up. It doesn't have to be overwhelming, especially if blush isn't like your favorite thing, but if blush is your favorite thing, which I know a lot of you guys love blush, look at this. I'm building it up lightly with my finger. This is not with a brush, this is with my finger and you can see it. And they have a lot of different shades too. I love that their shade range seems like it can really complement anyone. If you're curious what All Natural looks like, since I do have that as well, I'll show you. Next to Taupe, you can see that this is a little bit more of a berry tone, maybe with a little bit more of a pink rosiness to it, whereas Taupe has that more brown base to it. I think these are super juicy, super comfortable, and they're perfect all times of year. The shade slicks are $24. Mine have lasted me a really long time as well. Like I said, I've had these for a while. I love wearing them in the summer, in the fall, no matter what time of year. But right now my lips are really needing hydration with the cold snap. So this has been perfect. I'm gonna leave my merit link down below for you guys. Please feel free to check it out if you are interested in any of these products, whether they are just for the skin or a nice flush of makeup. So that way going into the new year, you feel like you're being good to your skin as well. Thank you so much Merit Beauty for sponsoring today's video and supporting my little channel here on YouTube and letting me share this information with my friends. I will see you guys in an upcoming video where I'm doing some more year of end 2020 do favorites, bests and worsts, all of those things. Bye friends.